I wouldn't say I knew what an investment banker was when I was younger. I mean, I, I think for a long time I wanted to be a pilot. That was like my kind of childhood dream. So I come from a single parent family. My dad died when I was really, really young. Because it was me, my mom, my grandma, and my sister, the four of us. Coming out of high school, I had to figure out a way to pay for college. The Navy ROTC scholarship is a great way to do that. So I went to Stanford and studied industrial engineering there. Graduated in 2001, then went to the Navy through the Navy ROTC scholarship. Served six years in the Navy, and then uh, did my MBA at Harvard from 2007 to 2009, and then started the firm that I'm at now. Hawaii, Guam, Saipan. I mean, I had, a, I had a great lifestyle when I was in the Navy. I lived within 100 feet of the beach. Uh, I was the only black guy out there in the water trying to surf. Looking ridiculous, for sure. I think in the Navy and the submarine force just work hard to play hard. I had a top secret clearance. You're part of a handful of people in the know as an officer on a submarine. You know the mission, you know it inside and out. I felt like there was really nothing that I couldn't tackle, you know, based on what I'd overcome when I was in the Navy. Some of the biggest lessons that I learned. Integrity, telling the truth, under pressure, being as honest with people that you work with as you absolutely can be. Those lessons, I think, transcend the Navy and create leaders that go off and do huge things. I'd like to think that at some point in my life, I'd be one of those leaders who, who finally recalls in their Navy experience how they were able to become that kind of a leader. I, I couldn't do anything that I didn't find challenging. The biggest risk is... You know, some client has a problem, and you've never seen it before, but you know you're gonna solve that problem for them and learn something new in the process. That's my mentality anytime I face a new challenge or I face something that I don't know how to do. Where it might like scare somebody, the approach that you learn in the Navy is embrace that challenge and learn from it, grow. You know, it's one more thing that you can say that you, you conquered kind of in your life. But thank you for your time. I'm sure I'm gonna fall flat on my face a couple more times here and there. But that said, I feel like there's no challenge I can't overcome. There's no, you know, fall down that I'm not gonna get back up from. My name is Tyson Clark. I'm an investment banker. I was a submariner as an officer in the United States Navy.